this is the largest electric circuit breaker that I scrap on my channel 400 ampere and three pull and the uh, height here is 26 centimeter as you can see and uh, width 21 centimeter and the uh, thickness here is 10 centimeter and uh, weight almost 5 kilogram very heavy circuit breaker this is not a function functional circuit breaker so I purchased in I scrap so let's open this one and let's see what we got for silver recovery Let's open surprise. Wow, here is the insulator, still insulator to pre prevent the fire when the breaker is on. This one also. This part here, so like that, is a, is a there is a copper with a silver plated, and this one uh, maybe lead or and here is a copper, and as you can see inside uh, there is a silver contact. With mixed with tungsten and here in the out out of the current there is a copper at the here is copper and this one is a silver alloy with copper look at that I had a scratch this one and this one is a copper at the back and the thin, thin layer here is a silver alloyed with copper so let's remove this one and That is still the steel. We're trying to remove this one. It's very hard to unscrew here. One. The three screw here, large screw, is very tight and I cannot unscrew this one. So I don't have any choice to destroy this one. And also this one. This is easy to crush because this is made of carbide. Also this one, you cannot remove. Now the two screw here is losing. Also this one. And the remaining one here 
is the corrode, corroded screw. I can't remove it. Very large screw. We crash the controller here. This is steel. Very nice silver here, baby. As you can see here. And finally, I remove the very thick copper. Here is a silver contact and the skeletal of tungsten. Here is a brush. Now the mechanism has completely destroyed. Okay, so let's sort this one. This is a really high purity silver. Ding ding dong. After two hours of operation, this is our collected material here. This is the exactly formation of the 400 ampere circuit breaker. This here is the source of the main line current then go, uh, go to here and here and here is a uh, going to the building here at the point here there, there is a contact silver but it's not a pure silver there is a skeletal formation of tungsten here i will show you later in my drawing and this is a this tree here is a high purity silver alloyed with copper as you can hear the sound let's see our very strong magnet neodymium very hard to open yeah. ah very strong <laughs> uh, this is brass brass and this is a stainless steel here is a copper solid copper oh, with silver plating and there is a silver contact here with tungsten you know tungsten is a high melting points they use skeletal because silver and tungsten is is hard to alloy they make a 
formation like uh, skeletal formation so this is the exactly formation of the contact here here uh, this uh, line is tungsten here and every hole of this here is a silver because silver and tungsten it's uh, it is hard to alloy they make this type of permission so that's why they make this one so next video we will continue this one by dissolving this gold uh, silver plated and this three silver tip how much pure silver we got kill here so yeah yeah 180 grams of silver contact not including the two four six 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 pieces of silver contact here we need to remove this one six pieces on the got here 180.25 grams so thank you so much for watching and please uh, gives me a thumbs up and continue watching because we are dissolving here in the next video please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel